Hey guys, it's Drew for Drew Drives. We're going for a, let's go for a quick spin in the ZDX. Today the roles are reversed. Yes. I will be the driver, Drew will be cameraman. Oh yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I mean, I have a POV drive on the ZDX. I'm going to do the testing out as a passenger now. I mean, so I like the car. It's pretty nice. Like the A-Spec, I mean, it's not as, it's not they're going to be the fastest. Like, obviously, it's pretty quick. It's an electric car. Obviously, the pickup and everything is really good. Yeah, and the, hand, the handling's pretty good too. And I, I, one thing I noted is how chunky the steering wheel is. It's super nice. On a lot of on the other Acura products, the steering wheel spin in this car is pretty chunky, which is really cool. Like I really like thick steering wheels. It makes the drive more fun and easier to grip the wheel when you're going at corners and things. I'm excited to try out the ZDX Type S. panoramic sunroof on the screen right here you can access all kinds of stuff it's I like how the screen's really easy to use you got Apple CarPlay Android Auto wireless of course you can access your charging from there ambient lights over there volume controls over here and for what it is I think the power's pretty good yes yeah. Like they, it could be a little bit more, but that's what the Type S is there for. But yeah. this one, I mean, has I mean, all, as all electric cars do, they're pretty good power delivery. This thing's power delivery is pretty good too. And for most, and this is definitely like a car like you want an EV that's different than what other people have. This is what you're gonna get, you know. Like I have a, like the ZDX, it's it's unique. It has a really unique design for sure. Ventilated seats, heated seats. Seats are pretty comfortable. I mean, a lot of people are like saying like the interior is really simple and stuff, but most electric car interiors are simple, you know? Yeah, going around the corner, how's it feel around the corner? The corner's actually really good. Good? Handles really well. Yeah. Not too much body roll, anything like that. Here's the Bang & Olufsen sound system. This is like the new speaker things that they have on the new, uh, on the MBX as well. So like, yeah, since the ZDX is Bang & Olufsen and Acura's partnership with GM, you know, they put that in the new one. They got rid of ELS on MDX. And then also, like, the screen and everything. And then the new touchscreen in the MDX, it's pretty similar to this. Because obviously, you know, Acura can't just go and make a brand new touchscreen for, like, on a facelifted model. So it's pretty similar to this. And it's pretty, a lot of people are happy about that. It's way easier to use than a touchpad. The touchpad isn't bad either. I don't mind it at all. And a lot of people who are critics of the touchpad, you know, they probably tried it for, like, two minutes. If you use the car for a day, you'll get used to it. And then you have like the storage space over there. It's a cool car. You know, if you want a unique electric SUV, get a ZDX, you know, it's nice. But yeah, that's about it. We'll catch you on the next one.